watch these two big, strong, unneutered males meet, learn about the body language involved, how to keep your dog from fighting other dogs, and watch what this owner does right with this guy. I'm gonna highlight for you an owner who's doing things the right way with his big, strong, sometimes reactive dog. This guy's doing it right. And during this video, I'm gonna break down. I'm gonna show you him doing something or him saying something, and then I'm gonna tell you why that's the correct thing to do. And some things I told him, hey, do that. Many things I didn't. I want you guys to see organically how this guy is and how you can be like this with your big, strong dog. It's an attitude thing, okay? Yes, this guy has the strength to grab his 190-pound borble when he needs to. I get it. But 90% of it is attitude and leverage. It's not even about strength. It helps, but it's attitude and leverage, and that's what you, many of you guys can learn, okay? You guys seem to have love to comment on clients all the time. And by the way, it's enough... Um, shaming clients, okay? You're not gonna shame this guy because he's one of the best dog owners I've ever seen, but some people, you guys do shame them. That's like shaming a person going to the gym, okay? It's enough. We don't need to do that on this channel. This is a, a, a channel that's helpful, okay? You commenters need to be helpful, okay? Or at least not mean, how about that? So, we are gonna highlight this dog. This is Kong, 19 month old Borble, okay? You're gonna see he's a little little skittish at times and he's came to me because he will occasionally not like a dog. Now that was the first thing on why I was impressed with this owner, okay? He's a little skittish right there. Why I was impressed with this, with this owner. You're gonna see Kong be better than 99% of large unneutered uh, guarding breeds out there better than 99%. He's an awesome dog, but this owner's not satisfied with 99%. This guy wants this dog to be cool with everybody. Now, is he gonna achieve that? I don't know. That's a tough thing to ask, but that's why he's here, okay? So that is the that was the first thing when I was impressed is, is when he said that. Now, you're gonna see some body language stuff too. I'm gonna break down some body language stuff for you guys and... <clears throat> when he, this owner is going to say something and then I'm going to break that down in the, in the video going forward. Okay. So why is this guy good at what he does? He's good because he's not taking any nonsense. This owner, he's just not, he's got too big of a dog to take a bunch of nonsense. So when the dog does something that he doesn't like, he goes and gets the dog. He brings him back, tells him sit down or lie down just like I do. And I'm telling you guys in many of these videos, I go, don't put up with the nonsense. Quit putting up with the nonsense from your dog who's just doing whatever he wants to do. Well, the proof is in the pudding with this owner right here. I told him a couple times that I cut out like in the office. I was like, okay, don't forget to go get your dog. But for the most part, this guy already knows. He His dog goes up and is maybe not great with another dog. He's grabbing his dog. He's walking him away. He's putting him down. He's letting the dog know that he can't do that. And the dog looks at him like, okay, buddy, I get it. Just like a lot of the dogs look when I tell him, knock it off. And that's what you gotta do. This is a 190 pound unneutered borble, okay? But it could be a 100 pound Ridgeback. It could be, you, you're not messing around. You don't need an extremely big dog to have this attitude. You just need a strong dog and you need to be strong. And you, you have this attitude, you're gonna fix problems. Okay, and that's what this guy does. That's what I do. That's what I, in almost all my videos I'm trying to get you guys to do. But I wanted to highlight someone who, who knows how to do it already. I really didn't tell this guy much. He just did it. So I want you guys to see someone other than me or other trainers on YouTube. This is a normal guy who just knows how to do it. And I want you to see a normal person do it because you're a normal person. All right, I'm going to jump back and forth on the um, voiceovers and go back and forth between original audio. Will you please let Prince on the deck? Kong, you go meet your friend? You're gonna see your friend? He's a nice boy. You're gonna like him. You guys stay right there, please. Yep. We just don't want you involved. Yep. Like where he's, they get weird around the owner. Oh, there's your friend. 
Here's your body. It's great, man. He doesn't know he's neutered yet, though. I don't think. He'll know in a minute. And he'd be, I don't, this trying to pee on other, like, pees on the fence, on the dog. I don't, I'm not into that. He started doing that a couple of weeks ago or about a month ago. I'm not, I don't like that. Okay. Try to get him to stop doing that. So I correct him when he does it, but. Good. All right, that was one of the first times I've heard an owner say, I'm not into my dog lifting his leg all the time on other dogs. That's a respectful thing, right? The owner does not want this guy to be the biggest, toughest dog in the world. He kind of already is the biggest, toughest dog in the world, so he doesn't want, the owner doesn't want him to be overly peeing on dogs. Now, why do I let Prince pee? Prince has a stressful job. I need to let Prince do what Prince needs to do. So that's why I allow Prince to mark on that deck that you guys have seen a hundred times because Prince has its crazy life. And But I like that the owner was like, I don't want him peeing on dogs through fences. So that was that was good, and I want to highlight that. And it's like, this guy's almost as big as you, dude. Big happy wag. The more the wag gets to the side is the happier. It's a, it's a bit high. Connery, chill. <laughs> Hey, you get down. That was, his hair's up a little. Connery, Kong, come. What happened right there? Connery growled, Kong went up on the fence, the owner said something, hey, and the dog stopped and went to him. What do you see me do in these videos? Dog does something wrong, go hey, and dog goes, okay, I'm so sorry, and walks away, right? That's him. Normal guy, just like you, you can do this. You guys can do this with your dog if this guy can do this with this dog. All right, he just said, hey, dog went, okay, my bad. God, 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 God. Prince, leave it. Prince, leave it. Prince, leave it. He looks great. He's just so big, I'm just like. It's, it's really hard, bro, and that's. That good boys, good boys, good boys. You guys are good boys. Prince, chill, dude. You're too small. Watch Prince lip lick right there. Did you see that? Prince is saying, I don't want to fight. Now you're going to see Kong lip lick in one second right there. That's Kong saying, I don't want to fight. These are two big, strong dogs who are saying, I don't want to fight. Hence, there's no fight. They're both communicating with each other. Are they being standoffish? Yes. But they're saying, I don't want to fight. That's what lip licks are. I've told you that before. Nobody seems to know this about lip licks, but that's Belly. what they are. I know. You're being good. Kong, you're, you're great. You're great. You're just too friggin' strong, dude. Like, he's going to win a fight. I know you're saying your pit was like, I think you said dominant over him. Yeah, he's... But he, he was younger, he's maybe? Don't, he's older. He's like three years old. No, but it, when he, it was when he was younger? No, I mean, this is like recently. They've been going at it a little bit. He's just, he's going to win. And so if he goes at a dog and these two get in a fight, it's just going to be a gnarly fight. Uh, but he looks good. He looks great. Yeah. I love this dog. But, like, I, I feel like you're like, I'm like... You know, you paid for a feisty Fido session, and I'm, I feel like we got to get him with dogs. He's just so, I, yeah. he's so big that Prince isn't worried about him, which is good. Prince is showing like, he's not. Prince isn't trying to dominate him. Yeah. He's not scared from him. Uh huh. He's not. He's he's like he likes him. Mm -hmm. Like that tells us a lot. Um, Prince will come out sometimes gun blazing. Like this dog's not right, or Prince will be super scared. You saw yeah. that. The bulldog, the, the English big, bulldog, the or, brown one. Yeah. Yeah. That was, was a like, big ass boy. No. Um, he was a big boy. Then he's not like that with him. He likes him, but I mean, we can only just do so much because he's so he's so strong. He looks happy though. Like, I mean, and this and, is a unneutered male. Uh huh. The worst situation for well, him. Well, that's what and I'm saying, good. and that's why I said. It's some unneutered males and not all of them. Yeah. Some he doesn't like and some he doesn't mind. Yeah, yeah. His energy, he like likes his normal energy, I think. Leave it.
So if you want to start correcting some of these, mm -hmm. let's start correcting some of these. The problem with that is a lot of times he does that. Good. I'm not right next to him. That's true. You're a good boy. You're a nice boy. Okay, can we... Don't recall him yet. It's not fair. All these German Shepherds. Two of them. Two of them. Hairs up. You ready to recall him on the next time over here? All right. Now. Kong, come. Come here. Grab him. Bring him back. Come here. Good job. Come here. Tell him sit. sit. And. Down. Oh, down. And tell him, okay, we're not holding grudge. All, okay, he, did is not come, all he did is not come to you. Right. Like, it's not the worst thing in the world. Okay, come on. Three. You go see your friends? He's already looking and at me. And recall. Kong, come. Sit. Tell him he's a good dog. Good boy. Because he is a good dog. Good boy. I believe, good job, I believe he learned from that grab and bring mm -hmm. back, and then he oh, was Oh, because I do that to his ass. I don't let him do get away with nothing, good. you know, so. Good, good, good. Dad, you get excited. Yeah. your friends, dude? Kong, you, Kong. You can see your friends? You can see your friends? You can see your friends? Recall. Kong, come. Good job. Sit. Release, O-K-A-Y, is generally my release. He sees me coming, is he? Yeah. I don't want him to like fear me, but he knows who the boss is. He should. And he's like, oh. And then after he anchors down, it's so hard to like get him to do anything. Cause he's like, damn, I'm in trouble. Like, no, I've said it to you. I just don't have a lot of clients that are as good as you. You're the boss that solves so many problems in life. Um, and that's why you have a good dog, to be honest with you. You hear that? <laughs> but she wasn't even listening. She tuned out when you got Wow, that's crazy. She said, I'm the boss. Did you hear that? Oh, <laughs>